Well designed in Star Wars Galaxies had a day night cycle, there were weather patterns and from what I know you could pretty much go where you wanted and travel between different worlds via Starport. You'd buy a ticket from an NPC and be loaded into your selected planet. And the game launched with 10 planets including Tatooine, Naboo, Corellia, Talus, Rory, Dantooine, Locke, Yavin 4 and the forest moon of Endor and Dathomir and also a bunch more were also added after updates, there was Kashyyyk, there was a bunch of others. Every map was a huge sandbox. The majority of each planet was plains and caves and random events all mixed into one. And then there were some cities and points of interest you could also go to. And each planet would have map borders, usually created by mountains or the sea or sandstorm, something like that. Some invisible wall preventing you from going any further. This here is the Star Wars Galaxy's map for Tatooine with several towns and spaceports like Mos Espa, Mos Eisley, and players could actually also create their own little cities, which would also appear on these maps. If you enjoyed this clip, you might like the full video here. Come check out my main videos.